Carbo Moses. What's up, everybody? It is time to do a break. First one of the day. We're going to be doing 2017 Panini Phoenix Football 8 box inner case break number 12. What up, Misha? Uh, you're just in time. Let's get it. YouTube time. Uh, eBay time, I mean. Anyways, I got a full case of the Phoenix. Uh, we're only doing an inner case, so I do need space because this thing is massive. I'm only going to be doing one of the inner cases. The other one will be done tomorrow at 7, uh, from what I can see. I'm going to do this one. I made up my mind. That's what I'm going to do. I didn't think too hard about it, you know? Let's put this aside. Don't want you guys seeing my love notes. All right. Good luck, everybody. Uh-oh. Good, good luck, everybody. Good luck, everybody. All right, cool. I'm glad he's working. You had me worried there for a second, Abraham. You had me worried there for a second. Let's see what we're going to get. There's some, there's some nice stuff in this product. I am a fan of the uh, the RPAs in this. They're pretty colorful, very pretty. There's a bunch of parallels as well. Put this here, and we're gonna start with this one. All right, guys, good luck. Maria, shake your thing. Girl, you better shake that thing. There you go. See what we got here. How's everybody's hump day going? There's a Lions RPA in here. I like the confidence. I definitely like the confidence. It always helps to, uh, you know, throw it out there to the universe. Good luck, everybody. Hot hands here. Let's get it. All right, karma is most definitely real. That's why I always tell you guys, you know, come through the chat, and put your wishes out to Uncle Jesse, so that I can hit for you. Starting us off with the Panthers, Curtis Samuel, with the black parallel. That is number to ten. Ten out of ten to be exact. That is a. Uh, that's an eBay one one peeps. continue the journey so game seven tonight I know you guys are gonna watch that should be a good one it's been a pretty good series semi perine of the Redskins with the RPA that is uh that's rookie patch auto if anyone out there is wondering where I get the lingo Matt Stafford Lions there There's also basketball on tonight. The Heat play. 
Jay Ajayi, Dolphins. I don't want to talk about the Dolphins until next season. Delano Hill, Seahawks. We got an RPS rookie auto jersey for Corey Davis and the Titans. Very nice. Tony Dorsett, Cowboys. Eli Manning, Giants. Ben Roethlisberger, Steelers. Uh, see, people now people come out of the woodworks now, finally, after I start breaking it. Like, where were you in the beginning when I was telling you to come through and let me know what you want? Brian Erlacher, Bears. Franco Harris, Steelers. I mean, it, it's only one box down so far, so who knows? Maybe I'll, I'll grant your wishes. Joe Williams, Niners with a patch. That is numbered to 79. Go Astros. Oh, that's who I'm rooting for. Kendall Beckwith for the Bucks there. Kareem Hunt, Chiefs. Hassan Reddick, Cardinals. That's it for that. So much color in this. Uh, Misha, what do you ask? I'm not sure what you're asking me of uh, there. You wanna you wanna talk English? Like, what will break ten be? Uh, I I don't have no I have no idea what you're talking about, Misha. I'm gonna need you to do a little proofreading for Uncle Jesse on that one. What break are you asking for? Like. Specificity, baby. I don't know if that's a word. I think it is. I feel like it is. Panini Prestige 6 box. Ah, see, now that's what I'm talking about. See, now, now, now the more details you give me, then uh, Uncle Jesse will help you with that. Uh, let me ask you a question, Misha. Did you read the description in the listing? If you haven't, go ahead and do that for your boy. Because I do believe break times are listed in the description of the listing. It's a word? What do you mean? Like, they don't have the break time on there? That's not good. Gonna have to talk to CBJ about that. Well, funny, I'm gonna need some clarification on that one, too. No idea what you're talking about. Uh, anyways, Misha, to answer your question, uh, the prestige number 10 is at 9 o'clock. It should be in the description in the listing. So Misha, is it is it in the description? I'm just curious because I know there were a couple breaks that uh, that did not have the time on there. The word I just it, that I just made up. Oh, specificity. Yeah, it's it's put it up. Look it up on Webster's dictionary. I think it is a word. I, f I, f I feel like it's I feel like it is a word. It's all good, Misha, you know. Uh, I just got to be, I got to give you that tough loving, you know what I'm saying? Because there are people that, ge like, genuinely do not read the descriptions at all. And then I got to answer messages like, oh, well, you know, I feel like you, you're you a crook and blah, blah, blah. I'm like, well, did you even bother to read the description in the listening? No. Well, then, like, you're stupid. Zay Jones of the Bills. Like, why would you buy into something you have no idea what you're buying into? Like, that is just stupid to me. That's the 99, though. That's nothing stupid about that. That's a sweet Zay Jones patch on there right there. Oh, well, listen. If Steel Curtain is using it in his dissertations and whatnot, then it's got to be a legit word. Specificity. Look at me. I thought I came up with a word, but no. I would get some words for, well, I don't know how many points I would get in Scrabble. Uh, I, I usually go for, like, words with Q in them, because there's not that many words in the English dictionary, or language, I should say, with the word, with the letter Q. 
So uh, that that's my secret to winning Scrabble. Carlos Henderson with the RPA to one. I'm sorry, two net and net. There's that. JJ Watt Texans. Chicka Chicka Wow. Semi Perrine Redskins. Gold. Montrevious Adams Packers. All right, we got to see some fire here. Where's the fire at? So much color in this. Quincy and New what Jets. Speaking of, did you guys know? All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna just throw it out there. I'm, I'm gonna put you guys to work a little bit. What is the only letter in the English alphabet that is not used for a state? Like, there's one letter that's not used in any state names in the U.S. Can you guess? Ryan Anderson Redskins. I figured it out in, like, my second guess. It's not that hard. Terry Bradshaw, Steelers. Especially if you know your states. Your boy? Your boy knows the states. Kind of. Taiwan Taylor, Titans. It's not Y. Wyoming has the, the letter Y in it. Damn, Fonny, that was quick. That was quick. Dalvin Cook, Vikings. Demarius Thomas, Broncos. Wayne Gallman, Giants. And what do we have here? We got a patch here for the Packers. Two-color patch for Jamal Williams. Fonny Collins. I feel like you cheated on that. I feel like you Googled that. 7 out of 10 for this Packer patch. That's pretty sweet. But yeah, that's the answer. It's the letter Q. Brett Favre of the Packers. To two ninety nine there. Let's open up another box. Smarter than the average bear. Well, listen, that's crucial. You know what? Speaking of bears, I hear that if you're ever attacked by a bear... Your best thing to do is like soil, your, soil yourself and then get into like the fetal position or something like that. My thing is this. If I'm ever confronted by a bear, my first thought is why the fuck am I in front of a bear right now? I feel like if you're, you know, getting involved with bears, like that, that means you're putting yourself in that situation. And I don't, I don't think I would ever put myself in a situation where, like, I got to sit there and consider what my course of action is because I'm face-to-face -face with a bear. At least in Florida, like, the only thing I really got to worry about are, like, you know, the, the, the lizard dinosaurs, I like to call them, or, you know, alligators, crocodiles, whatever they are. It's one of the two. Um... I've seen a few in my lifetime just chilling, grazing, you know, the streets like like it's all good. I've also seen, a, I saw a snake one time when it scared the bejesus out of me. Because it was one of them big ass snakes. And I had never felt fear until I seen that big ass python. And I was like, I was, dude, I was, I was shook. You know how there's, there's what, there's response, what are the responses? It's fight or flight. There's another one. It's called freeze. I froze. In my mind, I like to think that, oh yeah, you knew you, you stood your ground, Uncle Jesse. You stood your ground. Hell no. I saw that big ass python. On, all I could think about was Ice Cube and J-Lo in, in that movie Anaconda. And I didn't have like a machete near me, so I was kind of like just, just there. Juju Smith Steelers. Like not many things scare Uncle Jesse. I got a fear of heights. I'm not gonna lie. Um, but I don't play with like snakes and things like that. Uh uh. Oh no. Joshua Dobbs for the Steelers, though. There you go. With the RPA business. That is numbered to 10. 9 and 10 on that. Very nice. Yeah, Misha, it's like you said. There's pythons, crocs, gators all over Florida. It is not fun. 
Listen, Juju Smith comes out a lot in, in these products. In Prestige, and Phoenix, and Origins, all, all, all different kinds of football products. Juju Smith and Dobbs come out a lot for the Steelers. I mean, it's their rookie, so that's why. It's just a lot of people weren't expecting him to have an impact like he is right now. A lot of people were probably assuming, oh, Martavis Bryant coming back, he's going to get, you know, the number two touches. But now, with that whole little situation they got going there, Juju Smith's been balling. Juju Smith has been balling. You need a Patriots and a Titan. Well, I did pull you a Corey Davis redemption already, so boom, check that out. Uh, when I do the recap, Bengals patch there, Joe Mixon, number to 49. Of course, Wormley Ravens. I think I might be pregnant because I just got, uh, I, I want a big ass bag of M&M's. Dalvin Cook Vikings, like, you know what I mean? Like the big old bag, I think they cost like damn near $5. Like I had, bro, I wanted to go to like CVS or something today. Because if you want to buy candy, now is like the best time to buy candy. Candy is like half off everywhere. Andy Dalton Bengals. That's that's a little little known secret people don't tell you. If you want to get candy, the day after Halloween is the day to go. Dante Foreman of the Texans with barely two colors on that patch. Auto on there. Number to 10. 9 out of 10. A lot of low-numbered RPAs in this thing so far, which, uh, through my breaking experience, tells me, Merry Christmas. what is that? Oh, sweet. Thank you. Which tells me that uh, the rest of this is probably going to be pretty good. See what I'm saying? Tyreek Hill with the black parallel. That is numbered to 10. That is numbered 1 out of 10. eBay 101. It would have been nice if it was numbered 10 out of 10 because then it would have been a jersey number and all that good stuff. But still pretty sweet. Uh, you don't need to get fatter. Neither do I, AR Lope, man. Um, but I, at this point, I don't care. Approximately how many soft sleeves do I go through in a month? Damn. Uh, that's actually a really good question. Um, I want to say... In a month? Huh. Let me see. Let me do some quick numbers in my head. Yeah, honestly, I have no idea. I think probably maybe 10,000 sleeves worth. And that's lowballing it. Probably more than that. I pro we probably go through a full case of it. A full case of of sleeves in a, in a month. Maybe half a, maybe half a case. I don't know. I'm going to go with final answer a lot. I'm going to go with a lot. Uh, I do have to, uh, Topps High Tech Baseball, but uh, that's breaking for eBay. Uh, we should be receiving two more cases tomorrow so I can do uh, the number four, and then we'll have the other case for the website, for the store. I don't know what happened with the distributor. Um, I know that... UPS straight up just lost one package for us. So we're, we're in the middle of, you know, trying to sort that out. Are the spots ending tonight for the break on your store? Um, if it's if it's on eBay, it's going to go for eBay. Like, you know what I mean? Um, what spots are ending tonight? I haven't even checked the listing. I know that uh, someone asked for a refund in high tech number three, the Marlins, White Sox, Royals, and the Orioles. Uh, I was planning on selling them uh, through the store, uh, or you know, pretty much here in the room. If you're hanging out with me, you know, I was gonna extend that offer out to you. I'm not sure if he relisted those teams in number three on eBay. I will check when I have the chance. Um. But look, man, I'm not. I'm gonna be honest with you. I really don't know what you're asking. John Ross of the Bengals, gold. Jeremy Curley, Niners. Mike Vick, Eagles. I pulled his autograph last night. That was pretty sweet. Amar Darbo, RPA for the Seahawks. 
That's numbered to 299. Alvin Kamara Saints to 299 there. Von Miller Broncos. Dak Prescott Cowboys. Joey Bosa Chargers. Are there still spots for the high tech break? I don't think so, Lope Man. I mean, check, check the uh, check our eBay, uh, but I don't think we do. I got you, Sean. I got you. Uh, I'm looking at the eBay listings right now. Uh, we still got teams available for Prestige. Uh, still an hour left for all the teams in Tops Five Star Baseball. Um, same thing with the Prism Football. Let me change this. No, it's all good, low man. It's all good. You know, I, I, you know, you keep me on my toes, and I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Um, I will say this much though. Like I said, the uh, the Marlins, White Sox, Royals, and the Orioles are available in high tech number three. I will be doing that break at uh, at 10 p.m. I already sent out emails uh, for everyone in that break. Uh, you know, that'll be about three hours from now. So I think that gives them a good amount of time to, you know, check emails and get up in here. Um, I will send, I'll probably send another email out when it's, you know, close to like an hour to go. So, they, you know, so they know what's up. Harrison Smith of the Vikings, pink. I also on Jeffrey Eagles. Um, so like I said, I'm going to be selling... The Marlins, White Sox, Royals, and the Orioles, all four teams combined to one spot. I will be selling them, uh, so stay tuned if you're interested. The Sean Kaiser, the Browns, don't see too many of these. That's pretty sweet. That is numbered 5 out of 15. Haven't seen too many of the Kaisers, RPA. This is a, might, might just be a hot case on our hands. Corey Coleman, Browns. Truth be told, anytime I put my hands on it, it's going to be hot. You know what I'm saying? All right, anyways, Michael Strahan, Giants, Troy Aikman, Cowboys, Kevin King, Packers, nothing there, Curtis Samuel, Panthers, Pink, oh, damn, that is nice for the Titans, check out that patch, four colors on that bad boy, that is sweet, Taiwan Taylor of the Titans. That is numbered 8 out of 10. That is nice. What's up, Sports Cards Freak? Taiwan Taylor Titans there. Something's up. You was busy last night with the Freaks, Sports Cards Freak? Right? It was a, it's a pretty nasty patch. Oh, Sean, I'm telling you, man, your, your, your boy, your boy hits. For those of you that have been breaking with me, you guys know I hit for you. Is it hit or miss? Of course, you know, all, all this stuff, this is a gamble at the end of the day. Um, but, you know, if you, if you persevere and you continue to break with your boy, I will hit for you. I will hit for you. I'll say this much. Half the people hanging out watching me right now, half of them have received one-on-ones from me already. Sean's got one. Uh, Sports Cards Freak, that's two. I'm sure there's others out there lurking that have received one-on-ones from me already. You know, because I'm, I'm lucky like that, you know. I should be playing the lottery every day. At least like a scratch off every day, like you know. What I, mean? I, I don't think I don't think I would spend that much. What's the what's the scratch off cost? Like maybe a dollar or two. Let's let's go with the over. Let's say it's two dollars. That's fourteen dollars a week. That's twenty eight every two. That's fifty six in a month. About. I wonder how much money I can make if I just do that. Just straight up buy scratch offs. I was looking at one the other day. I went to go put gas. And they had the scratch off where it's like, oh, you could win $1,000 every month for the rest of your life or something like that. And I was like, damn. 
That would be that would be a pretty sweet deal right there. Oh, oh snap. For the Bengals, Joe Mixon and John Ross with the dual auto, dual relic. That is a sick card right there. Look at that. Steel Curtain already got three one-on-ones from your boy. That uh, This one, Bengal, is number to 30. The dual auto, dual relic. That is sweet. That's what I do. I pull one on ones, baby. You just gotta, you just gotta keep keeping on with you, with me. You know what I'm saying? Troy Eggman Cowboys pink, but eventually I will pull you some fire. Scratch off odds are one to three for dollar tickets. Hmm, those aren't bad odds. I don't think so. I do pull nice things. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Zay Jones Bills gold. You can take that however you want. Purple Tony Dorsett of the Cowboys. It is hump day, and I can't help but like look forward to the weekend. I kind of want to watch that new Thor movie, the the Ragnarok that comes out Friday. I am a nerd, so I do enjoy like those superhero movies and whatnot. Most winners just get their money back, like a dollar back or whatever. Stephon Diggs Viking. Like I have a friend. And he plays them, I don't want to say religiously, but he does play them, you know, a few times throughout the week. And, and I ask him, like, yo, dude, how often do you hit? He's like, not very often. I think the most he's ever won on a scratch-off is like a, a few hundred bucks or something like that. Two ninety nine for the Bucks with the RPA. For Jeremy McNichols, Julio Jones Falcons. I feel like, I feel like you're probably right, Sean. You know, if you buy enough, after you'll probably just break even. New ones are the best. Oh snap! Inside information: Joshua Dobbs, Steelers orange. So that's what I'm. I'm gonna be like, yo, my dude. What is the what is the newest uh, scratch off you got right now? And hope he tells me the truth. Dalvin Cook Vikings patch. That's number 279. 79 out of 79. That's an eBay one of one. What do we have here? Uh, Akello Witherspoon. Niners. Brett Favre. Packers. Curtis Samuel Panthers. That's it for that. We got three boxes left. I'm going to do that one first, but uh, before I do anything, I need to put these in some uh, 400 count boxes. Now, while I do that, uh, we are going to be doing high tech number three. Uh, the one that was supposed to go on Friday, we'll be doing it today. The case finally arrived. Um, I did have to do some refunds. Not a big deal. Uh, so I will offer that to you guys. I have the Marlins, White Sox, Royals, and the Orioles available in high tech number three. I will be breaking that at 10 o'clock. So if you're on YouTube, Twitch, or over on Breakers, and you're interested in those four teams, I will be selling all four combined for 60 bucks. And you got a really good shot at some hits in there. White Sox and Orioles hit a bunch in the high tech. Uh, I did say that a while ago, Sean Davies. That's the thing about those uh, that YouTube. The lag is pretty terrible. What time is that game anyway? I feel like it's an hour from now or something, like at eight o'clock or something.
Alrighty. At 7.20 Central Time, I think that's what that translates to. Tony George Cowboys. Not sure what the uh, time difference is. I think it's like an hour or so. Somebody for Ryan Redskins. Pink. Blake Bortles. Jags. Purple. For the Rams, Josh Reynolds with the RPA. That stands for Rookie Patch Auto, peeps. Number 87 out of 99. The Josh Reynolds of the Rams. Carlos Hyde. Niners. Nothing there. Eric Dickerson. Rams. Kendall Beck with books. Nothing there. Sweet, sweet RPA right here for the Panthers. Curtis Samuel with the three color patch. That is sweet. Number six of 25. That is nice. That is nice. Uh, so about an hour from now. Appreciate that, Misha. Julio Jones, Falcons, Orange. Chicka, chicka. What up, Kyle? Dalvin Cook of the Vikings, all purple. By the way, Kyle, just to give you an update, you remember how we filled the NT Baseball number block? Um, that case should be arriving tomorrow, Kyle, just to keep you updated. Uh, what do I mean by eBay 101? Dude, I can, I can make a class for that. But basically, you see how it's numbered 79 out of 79? That translates to eBay 101. Uh, eBay 101s are any cards that are, num you know, either the first, uh, the jersey number, or the last of the, uh, of the serial number. What's up, Falcon cards? Uh, so, for example, this is an eBay 101 because it's the last of the serial number. If it was numbered 1 of 79, it's an eBay 101. If it was his jersey number, 33 out of 79, it's an eBay 101. So it's it's just things people use on eBay as like clickbait or whatever, you know, to try to get people to buy into them and things like that. Mari Cooper Raiders. If you don't understand, I don't blame you because, you know, I, I don't understand either. Kevin Green Panthers. It's like Steve-O says, it's, it's stuff on, it's... That's really not one on ones, but you know they post it as such because it's kind of unique. Zay Jones Bills with a patch that is number two, fifty five of seventy nine. No worries, Sean. Uh, I hope it was a good one because I'm pretty I'm pretty terrible at, at explaining things. That's why I gave up on trying to be a teacher. I was never gonna be a teacher. Dalvin Cook Vikings. I don't have the patience to be a teacher. Mike Lennon Bears. Gold. I can. Uh, dude, Kelvin Benjamin didn't really do much for the Panthers. I mean, he's a tall receiver. So it gives Cam a nice target down the field. But, uh, yeah. I think Cam's going to be all right. He's going to be all right. Yeah, he's not, he's not exactly happy about it, but it's not like he can do anything about it, you know? Who knows? Maybe Curtis Samuel is going to start turning it on now. I can't believe Jay Ajayi is an eagle either. I, I, you know what? <sighs> you guys are going to make me talk about it anyway, huh? Yeah, I listen. As far as that's concerned... The way I feel, honestly, at this point, I don't care. Because, for, for all I... Dude, we might as well get rid of Jarvis Landry while we're at it. Because he's a free agent next year, so he can just walk away for and we get nothing in return. So we may as well just clean house. Because it's not like we're going to do shit anyway. So, and he hasn't been doing much this, this season anyway. The, the offensive line hasn't helped him at all, honestly, but whatever, dog. Good, get, just, just leave. Hopefully the Eagles O-line can open up some holes for Jay Ajayi. And the Eagles are going to be balling.
The Finns got a fourth round pick, bro. Yeah, Dolphins definitely changing their identity. Um, from what I've been, I've been like reading articles and whatnot, and apparently, the hotheads in the locker room are, dude. We got a fourth round pick. That's it. Um, what was I gonna say? Jarvis Landry, Jay Ajayi, and Coach Gase were the three hotheads in, in the uh, in the locker room. Um, so I feel like that's what that move was about. Coach Gay is just trying to get an identity, hold people accountable, and be like, look, I just got rid of our best player for nothing. What do you think I'm going to do for you? So people should be on edge. I mean, listen, we put up donuts twice this year. There's no need for that. So, yeah, Coach is trying to make a move. Hold some, you know, show some kind of accountability on on behalf of the players. We we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. I agree, low man. I I agree. I I agree. So my Perrine of the Redskins with the patch. Now we're potentially going to lose Jarvis for nothing. And, you know, and I, I can already see it. Oh, well, wait till next year when Ryan Tannehill comes back. Ryan Tannehill is not the answer. Ryan Tannehill is a slight upgrade over Matt Moore and Jake Cutler. But he's not a franchise quarterback. Like, I, I really, I, oh. Dolphins' ownership is just crap. Our GM is crap. The only good thing we have going for us is Coach Gase. Honestly, he's really a good coach. I'm really high on him, honestly. Um, Jarvis for Eli Manning, go fuck yourself. Fuck no. Hell no. Hell no. I'd rather have Jay Cutler back there than Eli, and that's no disrespect to Eli. But Eli, he's, he's beyond his prime. He needs to just retire as a giant. I need some youth. That's what really we need to be doing in Miami. We need, we need to start getting some young folks in there. Taiwan Taylor of the Titans with the RPA. I mean, who knows? We're probably going to start tanking now. We're probably going to start tanking so we can get a good pick in next year's draft. And then we're going to try to draft a quarterback. And I'm telling you right now, it's going to be a crap quarterback because it's not going to work. Or we're going to do what we always do. We're going to draft the old lineman and he's going to fucking suck. Exactly, Sean. Exactly. No, Sports Cards Freak just likes to grind my gears. Kareem Hunt of the Chiefs with the RPA. That is nice. To 149. That's sweet. Landry in a third round pick to Rams for golf. I would take that. I would do that trade. Uh, I don't think the Rams would, though. Rams got a good quarterback in golf. If I were the Dolphins, dude, I'd be like, honestly, just, just start start to get that youth movement going, man. Cut Tannehill. Cut your losses on everybody, dude. If I was the GM, I'm cutting everybody. And Dominican Sue. Like, there's few players I wouldn't cut on the defense and on the, and on the offense. Everybody else, you got to go. Trade for Watson? Yeah, we don't have the assets to do that. And the Texans aren't that stupid to get rid of a franchise quarterback for nothing. What we need to do is either tank the season or pray for a miracle. Well, finally, don't say that. Yeah, like Sue, Sue's been severely underperforming since he's been with the Dolphins, so that motherfucker got to go. Uh, Resign Cameron Wake because that guy's a beast. And Dominican Sue, not, 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 not playing up to his, uh, contract. Who beats the Eagles? The Patriots. Because let's be honest. 
Who's coming out of the AFC? Chiefs always choke in the playoffs. Steelers. Mm, I don't know about the Steelers. Maybe they have one final push. And they can, you know, do it for Ben. But I doubt it. And people want to talk about the Patriots uh, defense. Well, let's talk about the Patriots offense. You got to score points to beat those boys. Uh, Raiders. Raiders not coming out of the AFC. Sorry to break, bust your bubble, dog. But uh, Marshawn Lynch has done absolutely nothing this year. Um, Amari Cooper plays when he feels like it. Raiders ain't doing nothing this year, my dude. They'll be lucky if they even make the playoffs. Honestly, right now, I'm just pissed off. You guys want to talk Dolphins? You got me all, 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 all pissed off. So none of your teams are making it to the Super Bowl. That's it. The Super Bowl's canceled this year. It's canceled. For the Titans, though, Taiwan Taylor with the slickest auto in the game. That's nice. That's number to 149. Door set. Cowboys. Yeah, I gave up on the season. Go Hurricanes. Thank God I at least have the Hurricanes to root for. And they're disrespecting them. But, you know, it's it's warranted. Last three weeks we've been kind of... Uh, our running back is Kenyon Drake right now. Who I'm pretty high on. I, I like Kenyon Drake. You know, he did suffer a pretty nasty injury in college. Um, but I do like him. It's As far as the running game is concerned, it starts and ends with the O-line. If the O-line ain't getting no push, running back don't got no holes, man. And you can say, oh, well, the, you know, the running back needs vision and blah, blah, blah. Yeah, true. But, uh, you know, half the battle is also, you know, pushing the other team. So you have some holes to go through. You know what I'm saying? Alabama overrated. Alabama is overrated. And I fucking hate Nick Saban. I blame you guys for getting me upset. Georgia will knock Bama off this year. Um, I don't know. Maybe. Mahomes to 49. Patch for the Chiefs. But Alabama is super overrated. Like, who have they played this year? Nobody. All right, let's be, let's be, let's try not to be biased, uh, sports card freak. Miami is not the best football program, but we are definitely the swaggiest. That's another word. Like, there's no other team in the nation that has the swag Miami has. None. Often imitated, never duplicated, baby. Diehard Virginia Tech fan. Well, Sean, I hate to break it to you, but y'all going to take an L dog on on Saturday. Sorry, sorry, sorry to disappoint you, bro. Not to mention we're playing in Miami. Maybe if we were playing in Virginia, but not in Miami, the big dog. <laughs> you a fool for that. But listen, that's your team, so I don't blame you for, uh, for rooting for them. Uh, just know you're not going to win. Uh, so if you're a betting man, don't bet on the Virginia Tech. Because do the, the you know the Dolphins. You see, man. You guys, you see what you guys started, man. Just cancel everything. Cancel. Don't bet on Miami either, because you know what? At the end of the day, it's Miami, and uh, we're liable to fuck up. Yeah, Falcon. Uh, so you mean to tell me? All right, you know what? I kind of I'll give you something there. I'll give you that one, I, and I really don't want to give it to you, because everybody's beating FSU this year. Yeah, granted they have Francois, but in my opinion, uh, the quarterback it's not that kind of big a deal. At least not in college, I don't think. But honestly, I'm just hating on 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 Alabama. I, I really don't like Alabama, and it's nothing to do with the players. It's it's 
Only Nick Saban. I hate Nick Saban with a passion. Uh, so hashtag fuck Nick Saban. Well, listen, the fact is, Falcon Cards, Alabama has been ducking and dodging Miami for years now. And guess what? We're going to play Alabama in like a few years. We're, they, they're they're going to add them to the schedule now. So, uh, <laughs> Alabama going to get a taste of real college football. Saban did the Dolphins super dirty, dude. Saban did the Dolphins super dirty. That's why fuck Nick Saban forever. Exactly, Falcon Cards. Exactly. Let's uh, recap this. Curtis Samuel. Panthers. Taiwan Taylor Titans. Kareem Hunt Chiefs. Taiwan Taylor Titans. Curtis Samuel Panthers. Josh Reynolds Rams. Jeremy McNichols Bucks. Dual Auto Dual Relic for the Bengals. Joe Mixon, John Ross. Deshaun Kaiser. Browns, Amar Darbo Seahawks, Dante Foreman Texans, Joshua Dobbs Steelers, Carlos Henderson Broncos, Zay Jones, uh, Bills, Corey Davis Redemption for the Titans, and some Hyper Ryan Redskins. And that was the break, guys. That was 2017 Panini. Phoenix Football, A-Box, Intercase Break, number 12, eBay style. Thank you very much. We'll get this out to you.